Hi Hans, what do you provide uh, f uh, via e-learning platforms uh, for LAS users? Um, well, uh, Iversity online courses, um, they are, you know, they consist of three components. It's content, context, community. So it's not like in a traditional web-based training where you have a scoring package and, uh, you know, you click through slides with, with a few multiple choice questions. Um, but uh, there's more than that. So there, there is content that's multimedia content. It can be video, it can be uh, a, a graphic or a picture, it can be a presentation, it can be an audio file, whatever that may be. Um, and however you want to present your content but then we move beyond that and as I said then there can be multiple choice questions of course but then we also work with a lot of assignments where people actually have to do things so you have to uh, engage with the material in depth so uh, so once you've you know worked work through the content and you've learned something about the topic you then have to apply it in a different context so um, you work on an assignment and you do, don't do that by yourself but you post what you've uh, worked on uh, to a community of learners and you get feedback from other students on what you've created and um, do, do you meet your uh, or are you? Uh, I'm sorry do, do you meet your major Roy? Um, well, the big, it's big, big question is that actually for me. Uh, yeah, so measuring RI is, uh, you know, of course tricky in, <laughs> in, in education. And I think in, in a lot of topics, um, you know, you only see that play out over, uh, you know, several years potentially. So if you talk about leadership or something like visual thinking, that I, what I've talked about in my presentation, um, you know, it's, uh, it's something where it's very difficult to establish a connection between the learning that takes place in the course and uh, you know a certain outcome um, when it comes to sort of behavioral change, for example, and then it's even more difficult to connect that behavioral change to a business uh, KPI. But uh, I think there are certain areas in which you can measure our life. So, for example, if you talk about sales training, if you uh, do sales training in a traditional way, um, either in a classroom or in a web-based training, or if you do sales training with an online course that we create where you use video role play, for example, where people get to um, you know, practice over and over again how they react to certain situations. You know, uh, give me a 30 second pitch of the key USPs of our product, or give me, uh, you know, react to an objection from a customer. If you practice that over and over again, people do get better and they get they learn more than they would in traditional classroom training. And therefore, sales training, for example, you have a very clear KPI. How is that? person performing in terms of sales over in the, the course of you know a month, uh, six months, a year after the training. So I think in some areas you can measure ROI and others it's more difficult. Thank you All right. for, for answer. All right.